Good afternoon. Welcome back. Um, let's see what kind of trouble we can get in today. Uh, so, just for fun, um, I got some of these. Um, oh, wrong way. Uh, some of these panels instead of the canvases. Um, because I'm hoping to do a bit more actual painting, um, um, where, you know, I don't know, actual painting. Um, so I thought these would work better so that I could put them wherever, um, uh, regular canvases give a bit too much. So, um, so today we're just going to use one of these for fun still have our fun uh clear glue we are not going to put a border on this we are just going to pour a bunch of glue on here and knowing that it's just going to run off the edge that's fine too we'll see what happens um going along with that we're going to use some of our um alcohol inks just for fun just to see what it does with the the clear glue um yeah just gonna have some fun put some glue on here see what we get today that is the nice thing about um, impulse buying, ooh, um, that's interesting. Um, impulse buying uh, supplies is that you have what you need, um, no matter what crazy thing you feel like trying, so. If you find craft supplies on sale, take a chance and say, hey, you know what? I don't have something to do with this today, but maybe in the future, I'll have something cool I can make with this. So, um, you know, if you get a, Get a coupon from somewhere, or um, you know, if you get one of those rewards programs, you know, you can you know, get some, you know, free stuff. And then, you know, you don't have to feel quite as bad about, you know, experimenting. What is going on with this? Oh, it does not. Oh, Nikes. Well, it's not what I was hoping for. So cool. It's nice that if you get a bunch of color, you can put some more glue over the top of it and kind of break that up. I wonder if I have the stuff that says rainbow. I don't know what that's supposed to be, actually, but let's see what it does. It's interesting. Yeah, that's unfortunate that since the, the alcohol ink dries ridiculously quickly, um, it's just kind of there now. So I make these mistakes so that you don't have to. 
At least that's what I tell myself. That is what keeps me up at night. No, that's not at all what I was trying to say. Um, I don't know what I was trying to say. It's fine. It's one of those days. <clears throat> I think I would have recovered by now from inventory, but nope. Still a bit out of it. I wish I had the time to let this completely dry before I have to post this, but I will not. Um, it's been, been an interesting week, ladies and gentlemen. You think the fun stops with inventory, but nope, you would be wrong. Still got to deal with all the everyday, everyday stuff of working in retail. Like, somebody wants a day off. Well, you can't really tell them no. I mean, you can, but you know. It's not like I work in an office or something where, you know, something desperately needs to get done. There's only one person who knows how to do it, so. Um, so we fill in where we can. And that's when it gets interesting. It's been slightly warmer, so I've been trying to clean up our outdoor area, which, you know, is a lot easier when uh, other people are helping also, so that it doesn't get as bad as it does, but that's what happens when you're dealing with other people. Ooh, that was fun. It's kind of a little dot rolled over that way. Um, yeah, you're just kind of kind of stuck with the amount of effort they want to give you. So, or don't want to give you. These tend to look a bit better in the beginning, and then they just kind of keep spreading. So maybe the alcohol ink is not um, the way to go with this. But it did that. Um, did that with the, the unicorn things I tried last time, too. So um, maybe just plain old, plain old acrylic paint is the way to go with these. We shall see. Then again, maybe this will turn out awful, and you'll beg me to never do it again. So, <laughs> never know. Maybe not a single person will watch this. I 
and then I'll have a, as my kids like to call it, an existential crisis. <sighs> I'm glad sometimes that I'm a 50 year old boring white guy it is tough out there. People want to make decisions for you about what you can do, what you can't do. And unfortunately, it's a little easier you're just a boring old white guy. Which is unfortunate. Anyway. I know I've had some people uh, unhappy with me when I started uh, giving opinions on things. So maybe I should keep it to myself. But These are the things that you have to deal with when you have kids, so. That's weird. Did it dry on me? Oh, it did. That is so weird. Yeah, so it looks like the alcohol ink has actually dried on top of the glue. So if I wanted to do something crazy, it has to be right when it goes on. Or else it'll do gnarly looking weird things. But... Let's see if we can mix some of these colors together here. Hmm. Oh, I might file this one under regret later. But we'll see. Experimenting. Sometimes you just gotta keep keep trying things and see see what you get.
let's give this some time and uh, we'll see what we have. All right, so this one uh, did not work quite as well as I had thought. Um, it kept spreading out and, uh, you know, it would just kind of sink down and then spread out. So I kept putting it back on here. So um, some interesting little things here, but in general, I'm going to say this failed. Um, so now we know that, um, the unicorn stuff doesn't work very well with, uh, clear glue and that, um, the alcohol ink doesn't work very well. So maybe something oil-based would, uh, not just keep spreading out and being weird and losing color. So anyway, this is what it looks like. It's not dry yet. Um, it's going to be a while. I need to start planning ahead better. But anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Take some chances, make some stuff.